Hi guys, so today I'm doing Nike and Adidas trainers haul. So I bought quite a few pairs of trainers. I don't know if you can see. I bought about five pairs of trainers. So I thought I'm going to share them with you, show them up close. Just in case you are thinking about purchasing some trainers and you would like to see them on YouTube as opposed to just from a picture that they give you online. So the first pair is this one. This is from their running series. So they look like this. So these are the Nike Run Swift Nike running shoes. I ordered these online. All of these shoes I ordered online and they came yesterday. This is one of the most comfortable pair of Nike shoes ever. It's amazing for running, really lightweight. The sole is amazing. I think the sole is what makes it so special. Even though this doesn't have a very soft cushion, the shape of this is very kind of unique and just works per perfectly with your feet, I find. Honestly, hands down in this haul, this is one of my favorite pair of shoes, just because they're super comfortable. And I think they're really nice as well. Their soles look like this. So I think you get a perfect grip with these shoes. I got all of my shoes in four and a half, UK four and a half, and these ones fit me very well. They just kind of mold around your feet. My second pair is this one. These are called Nike Zoom Strike. I personally feel like they look a bit nicer online than they look in real life. Not going to lie, you guys. Nice Nike trainers, but they didn't blow me away the way the previous ones did. And yeah, so these are basically the from the Strike series. The material on these ones seems a bit more thin bit more breathable, perhaps perfect for the summertime and you get all the holes around. So this would be perfect when it's very hot outside. The soles look like this. And to be completely honest, I am not keeping these trainers. I decided not to keep them for a few reasons. I think even though these are the same size as these ones, I definitely don't find them as comfortable. It's really hard for me to explain this, but basically, I just find them quite uncomfortable, but just with my left foot. And in general, I just don't think they're as comfortable as the running series. Maybe if I opted for half the size up, so UK five as opposed to UK four and a half, maybe they would have fit me better, but at the same time, I'm happy with the right one and I'm not so happy with the left one. I don't need five pairs of trainers. I don't need to keep them all. And with these ones, I just don't think I would get much wear out of them. But you could definitely look into them if you are looking if you are looking for something more breathable, perfect for the summer. I also got two black pairs of trainers to compare because I actually don't own a black pair of Nike trainers. I think if I was to recommend two trainers from Nike in this entire video, it would be the first pair and this one. And it is the City Trainer pair. These are Nike City Trainers. It says right here, Nike Training City Trainer. And I just, I love these so, so much. I mean, first of all, I love the look of them. I love the logo, very nice and bold. I love this white detail here against the black, black and white classic color combo. I love the shape and I think they look really, really pretty. What I loved the most about them was the cushion. The cushion on this is incredible. These are one of the most comfortable pair of Nike trainers. Perhaps the running shoes would be better for running. I don't know, I need to test them in action, but I can imagine these would be even better for walking long distances. And the reason for that being is the fact that they have the Nike Comfort footbed. You might not be able to read that from here, but it basically has a label that says, squeeze me and it's called the Nike Comfort Footbed. And when you feel the inside, it just feels like a nice cushion, such a nice cushion. None of the other trainers in this hall have this type of a cushion inside. It truly feels like you are not walking on hard surfaces at all. And I love the fact that they look smaller than the other ones. I don't like footwear that makes your feet look huge. I much rather prefer something that makes your feet look small. My last pair of Nike trainers is also black. 
and I actually ordered them to compare them with the other ones. I didn't know which one I wanted just based on the name and the picture online, so I wanted to order both, try them on, see which one I like best and just keep one pair. And I'm actually not keeping those and they're called Nike Revolution. They're kind of like off black grey colour. I mean, I don't think the front of them is very black. I think it's more of a grey. You don't get that cushion with a revolution feel quite hard at the bottom, whereas the City Trainers feel very nice. So this is City Trainer and this is Revolution. I actually forgot to show you bottom of the City Trainers, so I'm going to do it now. You can compare them well. As you can see, I feel like Revolution looks a lot bigger than City Trainer. And the weirdest thing is, even though they are both in UK four and a half, I find the City Trainers that look smaller way more comfortable than the Revolution from Nike that seem bigger, but on my feet they feel more tight and not as comfortable. So yeah, even though they look bigger, they definitely do, I mean I hope you can see that on camera, but they look a lot bigger on your feet when when you put them on they feel smaller that's how they both look at the bottom so yes you do get a completely different sole but by all means i would recommend city trainers over revolution by depends what you are after some people may not like the cushioning some people may like the look and the feel of this one more but i personally prefer this one way more and then lastly i have one pair of adidas trainers and actually out of every single pair of shoes in today's video, when it comes to looks, this one is my favorite. And again, I'm definitely keeping them. They're called BS Advantage. And they look like this. They had quite a few different colors of them. Well, they were all white, but with different colors at the side. I opted for this coral, well it's not really coral, it's a peachy coral shade, let's say. They may not be the shoes that I would wear to the gym, I would definitely opt for one of the Nike shoes to go to the gym in. Honestly, VS Advantage trainers from Adidas are some of my favourite, that's how they look at the bottom. I am very happy with these and I love them. But yeah, you guys, that has been it for my haul. I hope you found it helpful. Please like this video if you enjoyed it and subscribe to me if you haven't already. And I'll see my next one. Bye!